Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of The Hard Truth. Today's hard truth is, wives, submit yourselves to your own husbands as you do to the Lord. And that comes from Ephesians 5 and verse 22. There have been many arguments on this scripture by Christians and non-Christians alike. Well, what happens when you submit to a husband who's homicidal? Okay, today I'm beginning a new series on familicide to try to figure out why so many men are killing their entire families. Okay, it's time to get that coffee or a nice cup of tea as we begin our story. Why are so many men killing their entire families? I mean, are women and children an endangered species now? Fellas, I mean, what's what's wrong? What, what is driving you to want to kill everybody in your house? Is something wrong with that? Is something wrong with you even having those thoughts, okay? And women, uh, we need some warning signs, okay? Who, who's getting ready to come on and snap and just wipe out all two or three generations, okay? Uh, this is becoming an epidemic, and I believe it needs to be uh, addressed, discussed, researched. I mean, it's happening too much. And so I'm opening up a new series here to talk about this, and I'm going to... Uh, just run through a few cases that I'll be talking about in this sort of like a trailer to open up the discussion and then uh, we'll take it from there. Vincent Brothers killed the wife, Joni, all the kids, and his mother-in-law came in the house, took everybody out, and ran back to the East Coast trying to pretend like he didn't do it. Chris Watts killed his wife and his two daughters and disposed of all of his own family in a field and in some some type of well. Anthony Todd killed his wife, Megan, all of the kids, and even the dog, Breezy, and then was in the house with their bodies for some period of time before the police finally discovered they were dead. George Wagner was sentenced for killing eight members of the same family in Ohio, okay? He denied any knowledge or involvement in the crime in 2016, and come to find out, he killed uh, seven adults and one teenager, all in the same family. This is not going to be a man-bashing series. They call this... A uh, family aside, when the entire family has been uh, annihilated, and I want to uh, deep dive into this subject and just see what we can come up with, and maybe develop a list of similarities and warning signs. Okay, much love. <laughs>